Hello guys, in this video I will show you how to make custom health modifier so when you damage this trigger you can see it but when you damage the trigger you will get minus uh, 5 health points and you can change it so basically you can set it like to 125 or something and you can if you don't want it you can just uh, damage another one and same for shields uh let's go into you at the end and i will show you how to make it with verse you'll be able to get my verse code uh in my patreon for my patreon mem paid members uh or if you if you will boost my server uh you will get the code too okay so i'm in your fan and first thing you should do is just make you know a board uh where you will place your triggers you know I will do it real quick. Okay, so I made my base uh, for my uh, shield and health modifier, and right now I will just add a tracker, and I will change the settings. I will change visible in-game falls, uh, triggered triggered by player falls, uh, triggered by damage on, and uh, receive damage when invisible on. A trigger V effects off, trigger a sound effects off, and right now I'll just rotate it. I will move it. I'll move right here, I will copy it. And after this, I will go uh, to my verse explorer. I will create a new verse coil. I'll call it Hello, no, uh, player modifier. No, I'll uh, call player sad things. I'll click create, save selected. Then I'll open the file. Uh, the next thing, sh thing you should do is you need to go to my Discord server and boost it. And when you will boost my server, you will get this code. Or you can go to my Patreon and become a paid member. And if you'll become a paid member, you will get this code also. So uh, after you got this code, you just need to replace it uh, with my code. It will call. It will call. Uh, it will be called um, a health modif modifier. You'll just paste it, and then you need to click Control S on your keyboard. Save it and go to your verse first build verse code and right here you should go to your project content 
uh, project content and right here you should search for created devices and you will see this player access device you just need to drag it after this you need to uh, just to connect your triggers with your help with your device so this is minus self this is plus shield trigger this is minus shield trigger and after this uh, just save it and this is basically it so we already have this shield modifier uh, let's test it so I will launch my session to test it okay so I'm uh, I'm in Fortnite right now and let's test this out yeah, as you can see, it's changing the help. And let's test uh, the shields right now. Yeah, it's for, it's, it works perfectly. Yeah, so thanks so much. Uh, thanks guys so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.